What's up guys? Here are my top 5 tweaks of September and October 2012. So this first tweak is called Hexatasker. This tweak allows you to have 6 icons in your iOS switcher instead of the default 4. Hexatasker doesn't have any settings to it, it's just an install and play tweak. Next tweak is Fumboard. This tweak has two versions, a free version and a paid version. They are both exactly the same, so you have to download the free version and respring your device. Once you've installed Fumble, you will have an application for it. Tap it, and you'll have a whole load of effect adjustments such as icon list, icons, dock, dots, wallpaper, and a whole load more. Tap the home button and bam, the effects are applied, applied instantly. That's what's really nice about this tweet. Okay, so let's talk about Slide SP. This allows a brightness slider in the middle of your home screen. If you have five rows or a springboard theme, this will not work as it should do. So disable that before using this. My next tweak is called Unfold. This is a lock screen, lock screen animation, which tries to give the impression of folding paper. You can change your number of slices, which is based, basically how crinkly you want the animation to be. You can set it to 10, 10 being the most, and zero being the less. Okay, so I had to include this one, Spring to Mice 2. It has been around for a long time, but I couldn't resist. Now, the most common thing people use for Spring to Mice 2 is to enable them to have five app rows, app rows on their device and resizing the icons. This even works when a springboard theme is used, so that's why it's so common. There are a whole load of other customization options for your springboard. Animations, lock screen tweaks, so you can you can change the status bar to whatever you like. But make sure you respring your device, otherwise the changes won't be applied. So to recap, we had Hexatasker, Funboard, Slide SB, Unfold and Spring to Mice 2. Thanks for watching this video guys. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe so you won't miss any of my content. But apart from that, that's it from me and I'll see you in the next one.